I'm Tina Grubbs, and today's devotion is on hope. Romans 15 says, For everything that was written in the past is written to teach us so that we might have a hope, and that God is the God of hope. As a child, one of the first verses that gave me hope was Joshua 1 9. Be strong and of good courage. Do not be afraid. Do not be dismayed. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. As an adult, one of my favorite verses is. Jeremiah 29, 11, For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord, plans for a hope and a future. Hope is the expectation of something far greater than we can ask for or imagine. Hope is the assurance that God is with us and for us, knowing that God fulfills his promises and that he is the God of second chances. His mercies are new every day. Hope in God, the Bible says, is something we are given. 1 Peter 1.3 says God has given us a living hope. Hope is his unfailing love. For God so loved the world, he gave his only son. And during this time of season of Lent, our greatest hope lies in the resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ, who willingly went to the cross so that we might be saved and have eternal life. And one day, According to Revelation 21, he will wipe every tear away <clears throat> from our eyes and there will be no more crying, pain, or death, for the old order of things will pass away. And he who sits on the, on the throne will say, I am making all things new. I am thankful for a living God and a living hope.